Assalamu alaikum dear students i am your science teacher for class 5 open book page number 115 chapter number 12 force work and energy force students what is force what will you do to open a door you either push or pull it this push or pull are called force do you know a body is said to be at rest if it does not change its position with respect to its surrounding similarly a body is said to be in motion if it changes its position with respect to the surrounding look at your surroundings you will observe that some objects like hand carts cars buses bicycles are moving while some other things and objects like trees sign boards and doors are stationary means still a force is defined as a push and pull which changes or tries to change the state of motion of a body when acting on it some common examples of force are pushing or pulling a vegetable or fruit vendor pushing the cart to move it a door to open it and a boy kicking a ball are some examples of applying a force named pulling types of forces let's now discuss the different types of forces that are present in nature muscular force the force exerted by muscles of our body is called muscular force weight lifting exercises lifting a school bag kicking a ball kicking a football pushing a door etc are some activities that use muscular force frictional force friction is the force that opposes the motion and therefore tries to stop or slow down a moving body mechanical force the force produced by a machine is known as mechanical force cars buses and other vehicles like sewing machine move due to the mechanical force produced by their engines elastic force if we apply force on a rubber band or an or an elastic thread it stretches when we release it after some time it regains its original shape and size this force possessed by a body that retains its original shape after being stretched is called elastic force magnetic force the force exerted by a magnet is called magnetic force this force attracts other magnets or substances made of iron or metals gravitational force Gravitational force is the force with which any two objects pull each other whenever we throw something it always come back to the ground because of the gravitational force exerted by the earth on that object this force is responsible for keeping us bound to the earth work suppose you wish to move a wall by pushing it you apply a lot of force on it but even after many hours it does not move even a bit from its place you feel tired and think you have done a lot of work on the wall but in terms of science you have not done any work in science the word work has a different meaning as compared to scientific definition of work work is said to be done only if force applied on a body it comes in the direction of the force energy the capability of a body to do work is called energy there are different forms of energy let us learn about some important energies what is energy kisi bhi body mein kaam karne ki salahiyat ya quwwat ko energy kaha jata hai mechanical energy it is the energy possessed by a body due to its position or motion of a body it is of two types that is kinetic energy and potential energy kinetic energy the energy possessed by a body due to its motion 
is called kinetic energy moving ball and moving bicycles flowing water etc are some com are some examples of kinetic energy potential energy the energy possessed by a body due to its position is called potential energy a block kept on a top of a building and stretched string possesses potential energy heat energy it is a form of energy which is responsible for the sensation of hotness or coldness we get heat energy from the sun and also by burning various fuels like wood and coal the, this energy is useful in cooking running steam engine and most important is that generating electricity light energy it is a form of energy to make things and objects visible to us the sun is the main great natural source of light for us we also get light from stars bulbs led lights savers and torches etc electrical energy it is also an important form of energy in our daily life we use this energy to run electrical appliances for example computer washing machine tube lights fans air conditioner vacuum cleaner and lcd are running with the help of electricity magnetic energy as you know that magnets attracts other magnets and iron objects this means magnets exert force on other magnets and iron objects this force is due to the energy of the magnet and known as magnetic force students now i am going to give you homework open your science copies mention date chapter number 12 force work and energy draw a margin line right question number 1 how do you determine the state of motion of a body answer is the state of motion of a body is determined by the fact that it that it is moving or not full stop a body is said to be in motion if it is moving and at rest if it is not moving next question number 3 define the following number 1 motion number 2 force number 3 frictional force number 4 mechanical energy number 5 electrical energy number 6 magnetic energy number 1 right heading of motion a body is said to be in motion if it is moving number 2 force a force is defined as a push and pull which changes or tries to change the state of motion of a body when acting on it now we draw a diagram of an object which uses force
वैक्यूम क्लीनर नंबर थ्री फ्रिक्शनल फोर्स फ्रिक्शनल इज द फोर्स दैट अपोजिज द मोशन एंड दे आर फोर कॉमा ट्राइज टू स्टॉप और स्लो डाउन अ मूविंग बॉडी नाउ वी ड्रॉ अ डायग्राम ऑफ एन ऑब्जेक्ट विच यूजेज फ्रिक्शनल फोर्स फैन नंबर फोर मैकेनिकल एनर्जी इट इज द एनर्जी पजस्ड बाय अ बॉडी ड्यू टू इट्स पोजिशन और मोशन ऑफ अ बॉडी नंबर फाइव इलेक्ट्रिकल एनर्जी इलेक्ट्रिकल एनर्जी इज ऑल्सो अ फॉर्म ऑफ एनर्जी वी यूज दिस एनर्जी टू रन इलेक्ट्रिकल अप्लाइंसिस नाउ वी ड्रॉ अ डायग्राम ऑफ एन ऑब्जेक्ट which uses electrical energy एल सी डी नंबर सिक्स मैग्नेटिक एनर्जी द फोर्स ड्यू टू द एनर्जी ऑफ द मैगनेट इज नोन एज मैग्नेटिक एनर्जी स्टूडेंट्स दिस इज द एंड ऑफ टूडेज लेक्चर प्लीज कंप्लीट योर होमवर्क एंड सबमिटेड ऑन कमिंग ट्यूजडे अल्लाह हाफिज़